Nichols, NB from Toronto, Canada. Hey, Allah Sheikh, what are some of the wisdoms behind him? Send, sending Salah and Salah on the Prophet Sallallahu since his reward does not decrease if no one was to do so? Wa alaykum as salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Barakallahu feek. Ukhtil Aziza. From the wisdoms is first and foremost is to manifest our love for the Prophet Sallallahu To manifest our love for him. And to physically show and to prove how much we love him. And how fond of him we are. And to always be conscious of that love and of the status that he has over our heads. So much so is that his name is no longer a normal name. His mention is no longer a normal mention. The moment his name is mentioned, instinctively, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. This is from the greatest of those what? Of those wisdoms. Also, another wisdom is attempting, attempting, we said, to pay back the Prophet sallallahu Attempting to give him some of what he deserves from us. All of which he has given us and taught us. And the Prophet sallallahu said about the Jewish boy who accepted Islam when he was dying. He said, Alhamdulillah, ladhi anqadab. He says, all praises for Allah who saved this boy because of me from the fire. Who saved this boy because of me from the fire, through me. The Messenger of Allah says something, he tells us, none of you can believe until, huh? I, I'm more beloved to him than everybody. His wealth, his family, his children, his mother, his parents. Munas ajma'in. Al-Hafiz bin Hajar rahim Allah explains in, in Fatih, that how can one love the Prophet more than his own parents? Just stop and think about how deep this is now. You never met the Prophet Sallallahu You never saw him. Not once in your lifetime. You're supposed to mystically love him more than a person who you've been with your entire life. Who fed you, who raised you, who took care of you, who made you, have, uh, who, who gave you what he gave you or what she gave you. Raised you from day one. You love this person. You look just like him. You come from the same blood. And you're supposed to love a man that you never ever met or saw once in your life. That is an extremely profound concept. And the reason behind it, Ibn Hajar Rahim al he says, is because you look at the benefit that the parents give and the benefit that the Prophet Sallallahu gave. The parents benefit, in most cases, just material and worldly. If that. Some parents are, are bad parents. Or they are extremely, they, they, they are extremely, yani, they, they fall short regarding their children. The Prophet said, Salam, his benefit is the thing that saves your flesh from the burning fire. He's the thing, his, his, his benefit is the thing that has allowed you to be a Muslim, to experience Iman, and then this goes on. So attempting to pay him back by asking Allah to give him more, and to raise his status, and to elevate his status. Well, that. These are from the wisdoms of doing that, and Allah knows best.